morning how are you guys doing i just hope i'm talking loud enough i know you guys can see a different background oh um, you guys i'm feeling sick oh i'm sick <laughs> not feeling sick because i'm already in the hospital i came in yesterday night and i got admitted like i never expected it and to think that yesterday i did exercise my skipping i was fine not until in the evening not until in the evening and i was just feeling a day cold everything and i just had to come to this too i don't want to do any self-medication because my husband wanted to actually get me drugs i was like let me just come to the hospital so i just called someone to come and take me to the hospital because my husband had to be with her baby so i just called one of my church members that we are very close and she is my tailor too so she brought me yesterday and i'm just eating so that they can fix um the second drip i've taken one i took one yesterday and it finished in the midnight so when they came this morning i said i was not feeling okay that i still have headache from here it's affecting me to this place i still have ache like i have ache badly so they and I was cold, yeah, so they brought another drip. But the line, um, see, this is where they put the drip, but it's removed, so the drip was not going into my body, so they removed it. So the nurse said I should eat, but she will come and fix it back. Hopefully, I'll get this chat today. <laughs> Hopefully, I feel better. Today, so that I can go home. I miss my son already. <laughs> I miss him already. Mm. Let me just finish my food. More music on DavePlay.com. from school yes i'm excited <laughs> yeah yeah go out for my camera we are going home we are going home hi everyone how are you guys doing so it's been two days since i spoke to you guys I wouldn't say I am 100% fine now. I would just say, but I'm much better than when I was in the hospital, than when I came back home. I'm much better. Yeah, I can say that. I'm much better. So, yeah. 
I just said I should come on here to talk to you guys because I've just been away, right? And my sister is here. Yeah, I think you guys saw her. Yeah, I'm excited. I actually want to shoot a video with her, but I'm just so um blocked of ideas on what to do with her. But we'll figure something out. Hi guys, so um this vlog I don't even know how it's been going like seriously <sighs> because you know I've just been trying to do a lot of resting and all but today this is Sunday evening I went to church actually you guys should ignore that bag there actually went to church but i didn't come to talk to you guys for going to church and all day i've just been you know busy with my baby it's clingy I, i've been complaining about that it's clingy and even is it clingy or clingy whichever one choose one and when even when he sleeps he still wants me to carry him i just had to drop him with his dad he's sleeping but once i drop him he wakes up so i just drop him with his dad so he should sleep a bit i'm tired i need to rest but anyways the main reason why i came here to talk to you guys was you know not during my birthday i spoke to you guys about anxiety i don't know like the way i'm having a lot of anxiety i don't know maybe because it's not as, as bad as this when i didn't have a child i used to have anxiety but like within hours or minutes it's gone but this time around like when maybe when it's my birthday or when i want to start something new or when there's going to be a change about something i just feel anxiety to the extent that i cannot sleep like i have to start praying to sleep like it's very bad and i don't even know what to do about it i don't know if it's because i'm scared of change or i don't know you guys help me help my life <laughs> at my life at my life i need help at this point but i just i think that i just i just have a lot of fears right now because of the change that is about to happen in my life i'm i'm not going to share with you guys in this vlog i'll just share it in another vlog okay so yeah so you guys should be expecting the news okay yeah Today, like this, I've cried because of this anxiety thing, and it's now making me very, very sensitive. Like when my husband just says something, like I just start crying, and I think postpartum depression is is added to it, like it's adding spice to the anxiety. I just feel, I just feel like that. You know, postpartum de depression is one thing that we women don't really talk about and i don't know i don't I, I don't know but i hope i'll share about my postpartum depression someday when i finally dealt with it and i've conquered it because right now i'm still dealing with it i don't think i have conquered it oh we'll get there my god's grace fingers crossed anyways i'll see you guys later okay hey guys so I just go back from where I went to make my hair and I love it. Though I would have preferred that the, the length of the hair is much longer. But it's okay. We'll get through with this. Okay? This is the first time I'm making this hairstyle. And I don't understand this edges that they did for me. 
but i'll pass okay anyways yesterday i actually wanted to vlog but i totally forgot like i went to the market i went to look illegal market again and i i like i wanted to do a detailed vlog on like the last time but it got forgot like totally i forgot i was vlogging but so there is no market vlog okay maybe next time that will be like two months after <laughs> maybe like that will be like november or something before i'll go again but anyway it's okay you get guys you get to see me buying stuff um, anyways i just said i should come on here to you know talk to you guys and also in the vlog and yeah i hope you guys have enjoyed this vlog thank you so much guys for watching and i'll see you in another vlog okay bye guys